learn to draw in minutes by using letters and numbers with Muffalo Potato. Hi, I'm John and that's Muffalo. And today on Muffalo Potato, I'm gonna show you how to draw a flamingo. You know those cool little pink birds with the fancy necks? Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of fun. And it's really easy, guys. We're doing it the Muffalo Potato way, only using numbers and letters. You need three things. You need a pen, you need a piece of paper, and you need to watch me. Okay, so here we go. First thing we do is we set up our paper this way and we're gonna draw a large S, just like that. You see that S? Don't be afraid, it's gotta take up about half the page. So let's put your pen here. We're gonna go up, around, over, and there. There's our S. Now right beneath that S, we're gonna draw the number four, just like that. Those are the legs. Start right here, go across, over, and come straight down. And there's your flamingo, guys. Take, I know, I know, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, guys. The next thing we're gonna draw is a C. Sort of like a lazy C, like that. Exactly like that. Now we're gonna start right here. We're gonna put our pen right here, and we're gonna come out with our C, come out around. We're gonna have it touch the four. Don't be afraid, don't be afraid, and boom. And now the next number we're gonna draw is the number nine, just like this. Pretty cool, huh? We're gonna put that nine right here, touching the S. Pretty big, too. So draw around, sort of a big circle, and then we come and curve back around, and we stop right there. Now the next thing we're gonna draw is a lowercase y, just like this. Why? I don't know, just do it. Right here, straight down and across. And inside this area, right here, we're gonna draw the number six, just like that. And the next thing we're gonna draw is a big capital C, just like this. We're gonna follow all the way around the top of this S. It's gonna be the neck of the flamingo. So don't be afraid. Put your pen right here and just go all around and over and down and touch. Perfect. Now inside this big shape right here, we're gonna draw a lowercase w, just like that. Only well, it's kind of like a lazy w. Exactly like that. Right here. There's our W. How we doing, Muffalo? Thank you for your support. Now we're gonna draw a V, just like this, only we're gonna turn it completely upside down. It's an upside down V. It kinda looks like an A without that thing right there. Watch me. It goes right here. And now, just to make things more confusing, we're gonna draw a V again, only it's gonna be a sideways V, just like that. And now in this space right here, we're gonna draw an M, a lowercase m, like a bird in flight. And the last thing we're gonna draw, guys, is a number three, only it's a backwards three, okay? So it's not that big. This is how you draw a three, right? Only we're gonna draw it the other way around like that. Real small and right here. And guess what? You guys have just drawn a flamingo. Now you can color in the eye, add some eyelashes, put some water around it, some tall reeds, kind of like this. And there's your flamingo, guys. Now, you know, take your crayons, color it pink, have fun with it. Remember, it doesn't have to be perfect, it just needs to be fun. I'll see you next week with another fun animal to draw on Muffalo Potato. Bye bye Uh-huh. All right. Muffalo says he wants you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook. We post new videos with new things to draw every Saturday morning. And you can log on to MuffaloPotato.com to see all kinds of fun surprises and neat things. What? Oh, if you have pictures you want to show us or maybe an idea on what you want me to draw next, you can write to me, john at mufflopotato.com. Make sure you ask your parents' permission first. Say goodbye, Muffalo.